It is a pleasure to welcome you all to today's MV public hearing on the European Citizens' Initiative for Safe Cruelty-Free Cosmetics, Commit to Europe Without Animal Testing, and strengthen the Cosmetics Animal Testing Ban, which will be chaired by Mr. Lenz. Three Schwerpunkte sind Ihnen wichtig, Schutz und Stärkung des Verbots von Tierversuchen für Kosmetika. European petitioners are showing great attention, commitment and the high sensibility. One of the objectives of the initiative banning animal testings in the safety research of cosmetics. The process, I will be followed by, by my colleagues who are responsible for the content, but uh, I uh, want to repeat what I already said at the hearing in the Commission. Achievement proves the commitment of many engaged citizens across our Union to campaign for their ideas to make an impact. Damen und Herren, wir kommen jetzt zum ersten uh, Panel. <coughs> Important to say that we co-organize with the Agriculture Committee and also with Petition Committee this public here in order to give the floor to the people. There is more than one million people who co-sign this petition and it is important to explain how the situation on banning animal testing is going. Animal testing are essential in a way, but at the same time we have to facilitate ECA in order to concentrate data and to replace as fast as possible all the animal testing in place. I believe that citizens thought that animal testing for cosmetics had been banned in the, in the EU for 10 years now. But the interpretation of, uh, of different legislations uh, from the European Commission and EU agencies has led to continued use of animals for testing cosmetics ingredients. There is still a big mistrust in animal free innovation despite the huge developments that we have seen uh, since the decision to ban uh, animal testing for cosmetics. And this is partially due to the lack of policies to, uh, to allow for um, a transition to non-animal science and testing. There are three different objectives in this ECI. The first has to do with cosmetics and we ask for an implementation of, of the ban that actually means that no animals are used to test um, the safety of cosmetic ingredients. The second one is to, uh, to start looking at safety testing in another way and when new requirements for testings come along that they are based on an animal testing and no new animal tests are added to the requirements that we have now in legislation to test the safety of chemicals. And the third one is a more long-term one because we want a roadmap established as soon as possible to allow for the implementation of a strategy that can move us step by step towards a transition towards non animal science. So this is a common practice in the European Parliament and the committees involved um, when it comes to a citizens' initiative uh, that they are organizing a hearing uh, jointly. It's good uh, to have this hearing before the Commission um, comes out with a, a proposal. So